Okay, here is a quick video to show you how I did this. Um, I know it might seem a little bit confusing compared to the other one, um, but I just thought it might be a little bit easier, but um, let me know what you think. All right, so here is the image that I have placed in there. So what I did is, is I made you basically a layer that kind of tells you what to do. So you're going to go file, place linked, and you can go and find any of the images. So let me grab a photo from you. Let's say it's this one. So it will place it right there. I can kind of drag it down and reposition it where I want it. Scale it down if I want to. And then all I need to do is this gradient mesh right here, drag it and place it on top of the new photo and then just turn off that blank. Um, and then that's, that's really all that needs to be done. You can kind of down a little so you can kind of get that gradient right there. So the, um, the brickwork is starting to come through. So you might just need to kind of bump it up a little. There we go. So th that's, that's all that you need to do. Then you can even, um, delete this, um, this layer afterwards. It's just the one that I, I was using as an example, save it, and then you're done. So this is the clock one. Close that, Let's save. And let me go over to the whale one. There we go. So you would do the same thing. Go to this layer right here where it says file, place linked image here, and then you go file, place linked. And again, I'll just grab the same photo and bring it up here and then drag the gradient on top of that one. Just, just the gradient and then turn off that layer and you're done. And you can just save it. And again, you can either delete this layer or, um, you know, just kind of turn the layer off. So hopefully, that is easy. Um, it, it makes a little bit more sense. I, probably my written out directions was making this sound a lot more complicated. <laughs> so let me know. All right. I'll talk to you later.